so now i will explain you how to find fourth proportion or how to find out the third proportion and how to find the mean proportion also so different different questions for every uh, part i will take one one question first let us take uh, how to find find the fourth proportional so find fourth proportional to so i am taking one question 2 by 3 comma 4 by 7 comma 1 5 by 6 so for this given problem i need to find out the fourth proportion so because we don't know fourth proportion let's take some x okay let so fourth proportion is let be x then when the fourth proportion is x this 3 plus that 4 together we can write in proportional form so then we can write 2 by 3 is 2 second one is 4 by 7 is this proportional and third one is 1 5 by 6 so fourth one is x so fourth proportion means indirectly fourth value so first second third fourth term we should find out then once the proportional uh, property that is product of means is equal to product of extremes will apply so before that we will simplify this if we do simplifying 2 by 3 is 2 4 by 7 and mixed fraction convert into improper 6 plus 5 11 by 6 is to x so we'll apply product of means and product of extremes directly that is middle two should multiply and it should be equal to product of extremes so extremes are 2 by 3 into x these are the extremes and means so middle two that means b and c positions so 4 by 7 into 11 by 6 so now we need to find out this we can simplify that is 2 2 2 3 so we can simplify like this then afterwards 2 11 is 22 7 3 is 21 is this side that is 2 by 3 into x but we need to only x value so 22 by 21 is all right side 2 by 3 if you take right that is 3 by 2 so reciprocal the fraction then again simplify Two ones, two elevens. Uh. Again, here both the three ones are uh, three sevens. You can cancel, right? X is equals to eleven by seven is the remaining. Then eleven by seven you can convert into a mixed fraction is that is one four by seven. Seven or seven plus four. So one four by seven is this uh, fourth proportion. So this is the fourth value. You can convert into proportion and find out the fourth value directly. now let's see third proportion for example question is find the third third proportion third proportional to 8 and 11 okay 8 and 12 So these two numbers, I need to find out the third proportion. So whichever proportion you need to find out, that take it as uh, x. So let third proportional to eight and twelve be x. To eight and twelve be x. So x must be third one. Then eight twelve x. So according to our given order, eight twelve and x are in proportion. That means first to two ratio and last to two. So overall two only uh, three are there. So what we can write eight is to twelve is the first to two, and last to two means again twelve and x. That means twelve is to x. So they are in proportion now. Okay, whenever three are there, also four are there. Same, first to two and last to two. So first two are eight and twelve, last two are twelve and x. So twelve is to x. Then apply product of uh, 
means is equals to product of x times property so when you apply that is 18 to x is product of x times is equals to product of means is uh, 12 into 12 then x is equals to 12 into 12 divided by 8 so try to simplify this 4 2 is 8 4 3 is 12 ok again 2 1 is 2 6 and 6 3 is 18 so 18 is the third proportional to 8 and 12 is 18 so 8 18 8 12 and 18 are in proportion ok simple only if you know the asking you can take which value you not find out first two and last two take it as a proportion and apply the proportional rule and now see how to find out the mean proportional find find the mean proportional find the mean proportional between 3 and 27 so mean proportional formula so directly I will say the problem so mean proportional so I explained previous mean proportional is equal to square root of that both is equal to square root of 3 into 27 okay the formula already know it so b is equals to root ac okay b is the mean proportion so this only applying then just simplify this uh, problem cc so square root of 3 into 27 so 3 into 27 is 81 so square root of 81 is uh, 9 that's it so 9 is the mean proportion so let's see one more question also mean proportion same find the mean proportion between 0 0.2 find mean proportion same. find the mean proportional between so decimals I am taking between 0 0.2 and 0 0.8 then solution is just you apply the square root of product of the two so mean proportion so mean proportion is equal to square root of the values are 0 0.2 into 0 0.8 right now we need to try to simplify this so you know already decimals to fractions 0 0.2 is 2 by 10 0 0.8 is 8 by 10 and simplify this square root of 2 into 8 16 by 100 separate the square root root 16 by root 100 and square root of 16 is 4 and square root of 100 is 10 4 by 10 is again 0 0.4 in decimals if you write and this is the mean proportion you can find out just applying this uh, root ac okay b is the mean proportion a and C are the given values so under square root of A and C is the mean proportion and we can simplify the problems also similarly which are given and this uh, channel is meant for only for educational videos and see these websites which I have provided the previous and the links also I am giving in description below and subscribe the channel because it's uploading only videos for useful for children and previous uh, and remaining videos also from the same class and other class also you can find out in this website.